hello guys welcome to today's video i'm fit abe if you're new here and i do a lot of corel draw tutorials today's video is on three ways you can put an outline around an image in corel draw so if you're interested keep watching don't forget to like and leave a comment and let's get straight into the video In this first method, create a new page and copy and paste the content of the original page onto it. Select the image and go to bitmaps. Under mode, choose black and white. And this box appears. Make sure line art is selected. Drag this handle to make the image really black. And then click OK. Select the image again and go to bitmaps here. Select trace outline so we can trace the outline of this image that is removing the main objects from its background. And also to make it smooth so when you apply contour it doesn't give this kind of outline. As you can see how rough it is here. And after adjusting the detail you can click OK. Now you can drag this out because you've traced the outline. Now go to effect and select contour. When you click on apply and you don't get exactly what you want, you can choose to increase or decrease the offset value. On a fill, you can choose the color you want. And then click apply after everything. The next thing you're going to do is copy this and paste it in the first page. And then send it backward. So this is how it is. You can choose to increase the steps. Let me just duplicate this and show you. Here we're going to go back to the second page to increase the steps and bring it back here. You can make whatever changes you want and then copy and paste it. And that's it. That's one of the ways you put an outline around an image. Now let's look at the other two ways. They take a different but somewhat related approach. What we're trying to do is creating a shadow or a clone and putting it at the back of the image. So duplicate it, go to effects, adjust and then select here saturation lightness you can change the color you can only make it white or black because you're like increasing or decreasing the lightness we want a white outline so we're going to increase the lightness send it to the back of the image and then you can adjust it with the side or middle handle so it's well placed. Well, I know this step is much more easier than the first, but you can change the color. In this last step, I'm going to show you a way you can create a shadow that you can actually change the color. So right click on it and select edit bitmap. It opens Corel Photo Paint. Corel Photo Paint is for editing pictures. There are a lot you can do to your pictures with it. 
that's how we click on fill tool and click on the image to apply a color up here you can select the color you want then you click on finish editing close it and now you can send it to the back of the image and place it well and we've come to the end of this video thank you so much for watching till the end please don't forget to like and leave a comment and if you're new here please subscribe to my channel so you can get more video tutorials like this thanks again for staying and i'll see you guys in my next one